Volkskunde, die Spiele von Berlin. Zur Feier der ersten Olympiade neuer Zeitrechnung als eröffnet. Opierając się na ideach Rosenberga, Hitler posunął się jeszcze dalej. Pisał, przywrócimy stare wierzenia, całą wiedzę tajemną na temat natury, boskości i szatana. Zedrzemy chrześcijańską powłokę, by wydobyć prawdziwą religię naszej rasy. Many Masonic authors teach and believe the language of symbolism got its start at the Tower of Babel, when God confused the languages of mankind. These men, realizing that they could not converse with each other in a normal fashion, began to use symbols to convey thoughts and later to conceal secret doctrines. Let's look at Genesis chapter 3. We're going to go all the way back to the beginning. Let's look at Genesis chapter 3 to find the theme of the evolution of man to Godhood. Remember, the serpent was in the Garden of Eden and he was tempting Eve, the first woman. And this is what he said. For God doth know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be opened and ye shall be as gods, knowing good and evil. Manley Hall refers to this in his book, The Secret Teachings of All Ages, and refers to it as, quote, the mystery of human evolution, and speaks of the process as turning, quote, man into the estate of gods. There's an increasingly popular notion out there spreading around right now that's popular among biologists, scientists, futurists, philosophers. It's a term called transhumanism, the double helix that is the essence of humanity. A book written by God himself that is to remain unaltered? Our first look at Freemason symbols is the ladder of Freemasonry. The ladder reaching from earth to heaven shows the ascension of man in evolutionary steps or degrees to Godhood. Related to the Masonic symbol of the ladder is the Masonic winding staircase. These chromosomes often take on the form of a cross or an X, and they're referred to as X chromosomes. It is interesting to note that in the opening chapter of Albert Pike's Morals and Dogma, is the rule and gavel of Freemasonry brought together to form the cross, which now we know is a symbol for the X chromosome where our DNA is stored. The hands of the high priest conferring a threefold blessing form a triangle. This is indicative of Mr. Spock of Star Trek fame. Gene Roddenberry, who created the Star Trek series, was a Freemason.
die Spiele von Berlin zur Feier der ersten Olympiade neuer Zeitrechnung als eröffnet.